Hello and welcome everyone to our new course, Substance Painter Beginner's Guide to Game Texturing. Have you ever wanted to learn how to texture 3D models to a professional level? Or what about creating game assets that look like they were created by AAA Games Company? What if I told you you could learn how to texture assets that look and feel like they were hand painted in just a few hours? If you answered yes to any of those questions, then I'm sure that this course was made for you. Here at Free Tutor, we have created a game texturing course devoted to complete beginners. Even if you have never textured anything before, with this course you will learn how to texture game props and environments to an industry standard level in just a few hours. Substance Painter, as you may be aware, is a pretty complex program for both beginners and veterans alike. The goal here is to simplify the thought process and make complete beginners with no prior experience to finish our course, leaving with skills and knowledge to texture your own assets and environments. When we all sat down as a team to design this course, our goal was to create a brief yet informative online class that anyone of any skill level could take to learn Samsung's Painter and have create a professional looking game texture asset. So the entire course has been built from ground up with this in mind and I'm sure that you will see that we have achieved this goal with this fantastic course. Best of all, Substance Painter is now free to download for students from Adobe, so there's never been a better time to get started on your own journey in free texturing world. So let's dive into what you will be learning in our course and how we have made this possible. The first part of the course will be covering setting up your models ready for texturing. If you are a beginner, it's important to learn the right techniques from the very start of game texturing journey. We will be going through the most common issues people have when it comes to bake and out texture maps. This will give you the best base possible before you actually learn on game texturing. As we move on through the course, we will be creating a wide variety of materials. You will learn how to turn these materials into something usable in all of your future creations. In Substance Beta, these are known as smart materials. And simply put, the more of these special materials you have created and have available, the faster your workflow will become. Now, we all know what the UV unwrapping and mapping can be, especially if you are new to the world of 3D texturing. So I'm happy to say that as part of the course, we will be covering amazing techniques to make the process a lot more automated. Next up, we will be looking at how to easily create your own materials from textures we can find anywhere on the internet. This puts the power in your hands as you're free to then use your own imagination as to what materials would you like to create. And of course, all of this will be done just within the substance painter itself. The whole thing will help you to keep the process simple while still achieving a professional 3D texture to your model. Which leads me to the next part of the course and it's going to be learning how to create that look and feel of hand-painted 3D models. If you're a fan of stylized art and games and believe you had to have years of practice of experience to get anywhere with your own texturing, well, I'm here to show you how to start a process and get amazing results in a matter of hours rather than years. Finally, to round off the course and give you a complete guide, we had to include things like alphas and decals. Mix this in with layers stamping and you truly begin to see your own 3D models reach the next level of detail. Gone are the days of sculpting every detail, most of the work can now be done through textures and these skills will help you learn throughout the course. I think with this course, we really have achieved a true Substance Painter Beginner's Guide and we covered most of the techniques that can be used within the software to help you create the best game texture and workflows for yourself. So come join me and see how far your imagination will take you. My name is Luke and I'll be seeing you in the course.